then Hari Hari Come carry your baby go Come and see my mother My mother Come and see my mother My mother Welcome back to my channel My name is Manola If this is the first time you ever see me And this All of this right This is what I'm all about. So there's something I always say before I start saying Shit You gonna see this message? Oh I got it yeah so go ahead and subscribe to my channel down below and make sure you turn on the notifications so you get all the updates on when i post a new video and you can catch up why would you want to be last why would you want me to upload it and you don't know and then you get here and you're like oh i didn't know she uploaded and all of that you know we don't want that whole story okay so just go ahead and subscribe so you don't miss anything that's going on here at word dweller okay Okay guys, so I know I've been MIA, but today I'm bringing something new, something fresh, something great. We are going to, we're going to be doing a full face with new makeup only. So uh, I had a little bit of time on my hands, so I bought a lot of new makeup lately, and I will be trying out all of them today. And the special guests of today are some brushes. I bought my first Sigma brushes. Here they are. So this is what it looks like. It's a really, really pretty packaging, very classic, and it has uh, four brushes, four brushes for it says, four brushes for seamless airbrush skin. I actually saw someone using it on Instagram, and I was like, oh, I definitely want to try this so bad. It looks so flawless, and it looked like it was going to give it the look of the year. So I was like, I gotta, I gotta put my hands on these brushes, you know. So it comes with four brushes, and they are Kabuki brushes, they're face brushes. So you're supposed to use them. Here it says. There's one brush, the F83 Curve Kabuki, is to contour or to apply blush. Then there's the F87 Edge Kabuki brush, which is to highlight and set the powder. And I'll be showing you guys each uh, brush as you know as we go. Then we have the 3D HD Max Kabuki, which is for foundation, and the 4D HD Kabuki for uh, concealer. And yeah I'm so so excited to try these guys also a couple other products that we have and we're trying today a lot of Too Faced products here I we are trying the Too Faced foundation right here and I got it in the color I got it in the color hazelnut so here's what it looks like also I also got the Too Faced Born This Way concealer right here and I got it in the color mocha I also got the Too Faced Born This Way setting powder and I got it in medium translucent. We'll be trying this hard candy stick, hard candy sheer and this stick it to pores. So it's supposed to have like kind of like a blur effect, you know, kind of like the MAC Prep skin that I usually use that blurs my face away. We'll see. So this is what it looks like. Those are the main products that we'll be trying. I also have a bunch of uh, drugstore and beauty supply products that we'll be trying. And I'll be showing you guys as we go. Without any further ado, let's get started. To start our face today, we're using the Milani Prep Plus Red and Rosé Oil. As you can probably tell right now, my face is super dry. So I can't apply that stick it, stick it to pour blow to my face just like that. I'm going to be looking super, super dry. So we cannot... We can't be doing that. Mm, I'm gonna apply all the way to my neck. Uh, guys, we're also trying this e.l.f. brow pencil. I bought a new one, but I don't know for the love of God where mine is, so I had to steal my sister's real quick. Real quick. <laughs> Let's get started with our brows. It comes with a two side, it comes with two sides. So, the how do you call this again? Oh my god. It's on the tip of my mouth, so seriously. Anyways, we're gonna brush our brows with this. And then the other one is the pencil side, okay? I'm gonna do a little a small disclaimer here. This is gonna be a little bit of a long video, so grab your popcorn because we're gonna be in this for a while, okay? You can retract it, it's retractable. More, less, okay? So it's a brown, a really um, matte brown. I like how it looks. Ooh, <laughs> 
Partout, partout, partout. Je reste debout, toujours avancé, je saute par les pas. T'as tombé déconné, merde, moi j'en ai marre. Je viens viser, la balle la décolle. Let's jump straight into the face. Well, no, should we do the eyeshadow first? I feel like if we do it afterwards. I want us to do the, the face first for some reason, I really do. Okay, so, because I'm anxious to try these brushes. So, I'm gonna use the Hard Candy Sheer Envy Stick It to Pores right now. This is what it looks like. And I'm just gonna stick it to my pores. I definitely see a bit of a blur effect. Oh yeah, I see it. Definitely see it. Now, and we have stuck it to the pores. Too Faced foundation. I'm just opening it right now. This is the first time I open it. Oh, the packaging is so pretty. I have used this foundation, not this foundation, but I have used the Too Faced Born This Way foundation before. Uh, but that was when they didn't have uh, many colors. So now that I do have my actual shade and I don't, I don't have to mix it with something else, it's amazing. So this guys I have been waiting to open this because I wanted to open it with you guys I wanted it to be a first impression I wanted this to be a first impressions video Ooh, how pretty they look so good they look so luxurious like you can tell the quality is top notch so we're starting to apply our foundation and here it says that we should use the 3d HD max kabuki brush and it is this one so this is what it looks like brush is looking right and that's the foundation brush I'm gonna pump a little bit of my Too Faced foundation here I'm gonna start slow and build it I'm really excited to try this oh it feels so soft you guys oh wow oh it feels so soft so I'm just gonna start grabbing the foundation wow I can definitely see what they call that airbrush effect. Wow, and that's only one pump, guys. I only did the side of my face with this. This is more of a red undertone because it's, as you guys know, it's winter. And unlike other people, I get a little dark. <laughs> Oh, my skin feels amazing. I'm gonna do a second pump now. Well, I did not think I was gonna use only two pumps for this. Wow, I love this brush. I can definitely see what they're talking about with the airbrush effect. I feel like this brush helped me save a lot of product in the foundation. It's really pigmented too. It is really, it says medium to full coverage, but I feel like it's definitely full coverage. So I have a little bit more product here that I'm just gonna put in the middle of my forehead. And these brushes were pretty expensive, I'm not gonna lie. So they retailed for $82 for the four brushes. So this is the foundation. Wow, so far so good guys with these brushes up next we are applying concealer and I'm still using the Too Faced concealer and here it is that for concealer guys we're supposed to use the 40 HD Kabuki brush and here it is like how this looks also feels amazing super soft I'm really anxious to see how good a brush does a job compared to a beauty blender okay let's go wow 
whoa guys I feel like these brushes are going to save me so much product wow guys check this out wow so far so good these brushes feel amazing on the skin we will not be sitting with the Too Faced translucent setting powder the packaging of this you can open it this way and just tap the amount that you want usually it spills all over the place with the setting powders but with this you won't have that problem because you can close it so up next this is the brush we're going to be using to set this is what it looks like and it is called the f87 edge kabuki brush it is precisely to apply highlight and setting powder we're going to be setting our concealer with it okay again feels really really soft sets beautifully I don't know I don't really like this brush I don't know for some reason I feel like that brush was a little harsh okay so guys we're gonna try the last brush I love the shape of this brush well I love it so this brush is made to contour um, or to apply blush so to contour today I'm going to be using my new NACAC duo I'm going to start with the lighter color. Like I said, what I definitely like about this brush is that it really, like a little, goes a long way. And I know it's also because the products are good, but also mostly I feel like brushes, the problem with brushes is that they, they absorb a lot of makeup and that's usually why people prefer to go with a beauty blender but with this I feel like your product really stays there I love the shape of this honestly it's perfect for contouring because it kind of has that up and then down so it's like it has that little line that you need when you contour like it hugs it hugs your cheek. I'm just gonna grab this powder brush that I usually generally use and just kind of blend everything together. Like when I use my face powder, it really brings everything together. So I, I don't and I don't really put I don't put any product on it. I'm just really just mixing it all, making sure everything is blended in there and going together. And that's what's happening right here okay bam so guys our face is done i've never really used this palette uh on my youtube channel so i feel like it's definitely new and new it's new but it's new and new but not new you know yeah <sighs> this is the beautiful zulu by julia's place look at that illusion bam and to prime our eyes first of all i'm going to be using my NYX palette. I use this color right here. What is it called? Shit, it's called Six. Next, I'm going to be using this pink right here. Now I am taking this purple. Now I'm gonna grab this 
blue right here. That blue is pigmented. I'm grabbing this purple eyeliner. Guys, and now I'm gonna do the same thing on the other side, but since I already showed you exactly what I'm doing, I'll be back in a minute. So guys, I actually purchased something really interesting on Amazon. They had these liners and stamp together. So let me show you how it works. This is for the left eye. Let me see. So this is what you do. You just stamp it and it gives you a wing. So let me show you guys how it works. So I'm going to do it on my right eye first. It kind of helps you. It gives you a base for your wing liner. If you have one that usually goes a little bit more up than the other one, this would definitely be a helper. So I'm gonna do the right wing with this. So this is how it is. Ready? Now yeah, that's your wing. And then you're gonna draw the other part. And I'm gonna do the other side. I actually don't line with this. Press it. Bam. So that's how we get our wings. Now I'm going to grab my NYX eyeliner, which is also new. I've heard so many good things about it, honestly, and I had to put my hands on it. So we're using the NYX. Okay, I'm liking this eyeliner. For our lashes today, we are using, you already know, I'm using my favorite lashes by Four Lashes, which is crazed. So I'm grabbing my Zulu palette again. I'm going with my Wet n Wild Fanatic Mascara. Well, I'm using this brush again to apply my blush because I want to see how well it's going to work. I'm using my Naked Duo blush. Ooh, me like it. What I seriously like about this product is that, like I said, oh my god, you just use a little bit, but then it's just so much on your face. Definitely for saving some product. Now we're gonna go ahead and highlight our face. And for that I am using the Nick I'm using the Naked Beauty Perfection Highlighter. I don't know how you guys feel about liquid highlighters, but it's not for me. Touch highlighting powder. I think it makes a beautiful combo. Knows what she wants. If you want to tidy me and do what you want, then hurry, hurry. Last but not lips. <laughs> Whoa, last but not lips. Last but not least, uh, I'm using this purple lipstick. Oh wow, look at that pigment. Sometimes I have good days, sometimes I have bad ones when I have to line my lips. But today looks like it's a pretty good day. Guys, we are done with this look and I'm just going to set my face with my found makeup spray. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys like the new products that I tried today. I love... Whoa. When I look at my face right now, I'm just like, whoa, they look amazing. That foundation looks amazing. Uh, the setting palette is amazing. It's just the, enough highlight for my face. And uh, I just love what's going on in my face right now. I just love it, and I hope you guys love it as well. Uh, please let me know down below if you want me to talk a little bit more about a certain product. Um, I will be happy to do so. 
Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And follow me on all my social media platforms. That's Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and Snapchat. And I will see you guys in my next video.